All information about the disease refer to the website, 247naturalhealthtricks.com IgA nephropathy, Berger's disease. IgA nephropathy, Berger's disease, is a kidney disease that occurs when IgA deposits build up in the kidney, causing inflammation that damages the kidney tissue. Over time, hinder your kidney's ability to filter waste from the blood. IgA is an antibody, a protein made by the immune system, to protect the body from foreign substances, such as bacteria or viruses. IgA nephropathy usually progresses slowly over many years, but the course of the disease varies from person to person. Some people leak blood in their urine without a problem. Some eventually get fully relieved, but others have end-stage renal failure. There is no cure for IgA kidney disease, but some medications can slow the treatment process. Most people with IgA nephropathy receive care from a nephrologist, a doctor who specializes in treating people with kidney disease. Keeping your blood pressure under control and lowering your cholesterol levels also slows the disease. How does IgA nephropathy affect the kidneys? IgA nephropathy affects the kidneys by attacking the glomeruli. Platelets are a collection of circulating blood vessels in the nephron. The small working units of the kidney that filter waste and remove fluid from the blood. The accumulation of IgA deposits causes inflammation and damage to the glomeruli, causing the kidney to leak blood and protein into the urine. The damage can result in scarring of nephrons, progresses slowly over many years. IgA nephropathy can lead to end-stage kidney disease ESRD. the kidney is no longer working well enough to keep a person healthy. When a person's kidneys fail, they will have to undergo treatment, transplant or hemodialysis dialysis. What causes IgA nephropathy? People with IgA nephropathy have an increased blood level of IgA that contains less of a special sugar, galactose, than normal. As a result, antibodies circulating in the blood to attach to the galactose-deficient IgA and form a clump. This clump is also called an immune complex. Some of the clumps become stuck in the glomerulus of the nephron and cause inflammation and damage. So, the cause may be due to the following. Genes. IgA nephropathy is more common in some families and in certain ethnic groups. Liver diseases. These include cirrhosis, a condition in which scar tissue replaces normal tissue within the liver, and chronic hepatitis B and C infections. Celiac disease. Eating gluten, a protein found in most grains, triggers this digestive condition. Infections. These include HIV and some bacterial infections. What are the signs and symptoms? In its early stages, IgA nephropathy may have no symptoms, it can be silent for years or even decades. Signs and symptoms of IgA nephropathy include Hematuria Once symptoms appear, the most common is hematuria, or blood in the urine. Hematuria is a sign of damaged glomeruli. Blood in the urine may appear during or shortly after a cold, sore throat or other respiratory infection. The amount of blood is visible to the naked eye. The urine may turn pink or the color of tea or cola. Sometimes a person may have dark or bloody urine. It is so small that it can only be detected by special medical tests. Albuminoria. Another symptom of IgA nephropathy is albuminoria when a person has urine that contains an increased amount of albumin. A protein commonly found in the blood, or a large amount of protein in the urine. Albumin is the main protein in the blood. Healthy kidneys keep most of the proteins in your blood from leaking into the urine. When the platelets are damaged, large amounts of protein leak out of the blood into the urine. When albumin leaks into the urine, the blood loses its ability to absorb extra fluid from the body. Too much fluid in the body can cause swelling, or swelling, usually in the legs, feet or ankles and is less common in the hands or face. Foamy urine is another sign of albuminoria. Some people with IgA nephropathy have both hematuria and albuminoria. Pain in the one or both sides of your back below your ribs. High blood pressure. Risk factors of IgA nephropathy. These factors might increase your risk of developing this condition. Family history. In some cases, IgA nephropathy appears to run in families, indicating that genetic factors contribute to the disease. Age. 
most often develops between the late teens and late 30s. Ethnicity. More common in whites and Asians than it is in blacks. Sex. In North America and Western Europe, IgA nephropathy affects at least twice as many men as it does women. Complications of IgA nephropathy In fact, many cases go undiagnosed. Other people develop one or more of the following complications. High cholesterol. High levels of cholesterol can increase your risk of a heart attack. Acute kidney failure. When your kidneys lose their filtering ability due to IgA deposits, waste products build up quickly in your blood. High blood pressure. Damage to your kidneys from IgA deposits can raise your blood pressure. High blood pressure can cause further damage to your kidneys. Chronic kidney disease. IgA renal disease can cause your kidneys to gradually stop functioning. Then permanent dialysis or a kidney transplant is needed to live. Nephrotic syndrome. This is a group of problems that can be caused by damage to the glomeruli. Including high urine protein levels, low blood protein levels, high cholesterol and lipids, and swelling of your eyelids, feet and abdomen. Heart or cardiovascular problems. Henoch Schonlein purpura. How to treat IgA renal disease. Some people need only monitoring to determine whether the disease is getting worse. For others, a number of medications can slow disease progress and help manage symptoms. Medications to treat IgA renal disease include High blood pressure medications Taking angiotensin-converting enzyme ACE, inhibitors or angiotensin receptor blockers ARBs, can lower your blood pressure and reduce protein loss. However, discover how to reduce high blood pressure naturally without medication, exercise easily, gently and effectively. Link in the description. Diuretics. These help to remove extra fluid from your blood. Removing extra fluids may help improve blood pressure control. Treatment with satins. When you have high cholesterol, cholesterol-lowering medications can help control it and slow down the process of kidney damage. In particular, completely clean out the plaque buildup in your arteries to drop your cholesterol to a healthy level too and boost your physical and mental energy. Link in the description. Immunosuppressant drugs. In some cases, corticosteroid drugs. Such as prednison and other strong drugs, suppress the immune response. Immunosuppressant drugs may keep your immune system from attacking your glomeruli. These drugs can cause serious side effects, such as high blood pressure, high blood sugar and an increased risk of infection. Omega-3 fatty acids. These fats, available in fish oil supplements in the diet, can reduce glomerular inflammation without harmful side effects. Talk to your doctor before you start supplements. The ultimate goal is to avoid the need for dialysis or a kidney transplant. But in some cases, dialysis or transplantation is necessary. Lifestyle and home remedies. To help keep your kidneys healthier. Take steps to reduce your blood pressure. Keeping your blood pressure levels near normal can help slow kidney damage from IgA renal disease. Healthy changes in your lifestyle. Such as limiting your salt intake, losing excess weight, being physically active. Using alcohol in moderation and taking your blood pressure medications as prescribed. That are ways to keep your blood pressure under control. Monitor your blood pressure at home. Note each reading and bring this record with you to your doctor's appointments. Eat less protein. Reducing the amount of protein you eat, and taking steps to decrease your cholesterol levels, may help slow the progression of IgA renal disease, and protect your kidneys. Step-by-step -step program, solutions for kidney disease. Recover your health without using drugs. Reverse your impaired kidney function naturally. Avoid dialysis. Avoid kidney surgery. Link in the description. Thank for watching. Good health.